It is the 26th of the 10th, 2011, and this is today's climate change update. I'm going to start tonight's video on um, a little what's up Mr. Too Tough sent me this morning uh, as I picked it up. <clears throat> Apparently on the 28th, and if that date doesn't ring any bells for anyone, um, you might want to do a little homework. There's supposed to be a global uh, strike uh, called for um, on the Occupy movement. And uh, basically, you're supposed to turn off your electricity, don't use the internet, don't go shopping, blah, blah, blah. Um, I will attach the video to that below, and um, if you choose to support that, the 28th should be an interesting day for everyone. Well, let's start Earth Changes Scott.net tonight. Sky lights up red and green as reports of fireballs entering atmosphere conflict with the CME Northern Lights reports from NASA spaceweather.com. Uh, apparently, <clears throat> some reports of meteor event in North and South Carolina, as well as Georgia, are lighting up the internet as large parts of Central and Eastern United States witness green and red lights across the sky from what was an apparent CME hit. And apparently the lights were seen as far south as Arkansas, uh, including the state of Iowa, which I did not see them. It, it happened at, uh, I think they were saying it was like 2 p.m. Eastern, daylight time and uh, that's the next story night red night aurora bursts over US skies and thousands affected by flooding in Mexico several ri rivers in southeastern Mexico spilled over their banks in recent days and uh, has affected up to 90,000 residents and of course that was uh, the hurricane that rolled through while it was still a tropical storm Costa Rica 4.8 quake shakes around the Barva volcano and so we have yet another volcano rumbling up in Costa Rica area I believe they have two or three going on right now <clears throat> mounting crisis one-third of Thailand now underwater and obviously they've declared a state of emergency and uh, <clears throat> worst flooding in 50 years they're saying of course, Rena becomes a 17 hur hurricane this season, and uh, that's the one where the reports from flooding in southern Mexico, uh, of course, Central America is dealing with this hurricane that just kind of it's been meandering around there for several days. 20 million tons of tsunami debris is closing in on Hawaii. Televisions, fridges, and furniture are pieces of heading for Hawaii as a huge amount of debris from Japan's earthquake sails across the Pacific. Up to 20 million tons of debris from the earthquake in March is traveling faster than expected and could reach the U.S. West Coast in three years. And of course, they had that Russian ship that went out there, they had film out where they were pulling boats out of the water and whatnot. Uh, what they're not telling you is <clears throat> this tsunami debris is radioactive. And it's been in radioactive water, which means that radioactive water is going to reach Hawaii uh, rather shortly. So a heads up on what's going on out of Fukushima. And then, of course, Mount Etna began to erupt again, um, sending s flames into the sky over Sicily, and they have a, a video on that. Over to the extinction protocol. Uh, the earthquake from Turkey death toll rises drastically as rescuers shift through debris. Uh, they're recording 459 dead. I'm sure it'll be much more than that when they were done with this. Uh, the devastation videos that are coming out of Turkey are, are pretty eye-opening. 400 meter wide asteroid to make pass by Earth. And uh, 1,300 foot wide asteroid which is more than a one and a half times the length of a soccer pitch will pass within 0.85 lunar distance from Earth on November 8th and 9th. Uh, happens all the time. They just happen to catch this big one, and, and they say it's kind of spherical in nature. Uh, dark rock. And there's the Aurora, Costa Rica, Thailand. And, of course, after the revolution, interim leader to bring Sharian law to Libya. So, um, good luck, Libya. Central Bank and Shia law. You're just... Whew. And the Vatican calls for the establishment of a central world bank. And if that doesn't tell you it's corrupt all the way to the top, nothing will. 
Over to the RSOE today, we have a snowstorm coming out of Wyoming, uh, Denver. They're saying they're getting up to a foot and a half, two feet of snow. Uh, just winter time in the Rockies. Uh, flash flooding in Italy. They've had some severe rains, uh, some rivers going over their banks. Uh, flooding in Ireland. Uh, they've had extensive rain, and they were talking about an unusual high tide, which is making the flooding worse. Um, just sustained rain. Uh, constant going on in, in the Ireland area. And that is about on the climate change. I did want to share one um, Fukushima story with you, and of course you should be paying extreme attention to this. I will attach some update videos that some ex outstanding YouTube channels have been um, putting out, of course, and uh, being able to keep you up to date what's going on. And uh, where is that? Where is that? Obviously worrying. New estimates says Fukushima released far more radiation than Japan claims. The government didn't count what went over the Pacific. Nobody's counting what's went over the Pacific. So, uh, heads up, enjoy while you can, and I'll see you next time, everybody. Thanks.